It has been recommended that you have a study to monitor the way you breathe while you sleep. The Embleta MPR recording device allows you to undergo a sleep study in the comfort of your own home. This diagnostic study will reveal whether you have a sleep disorder. The most common types of sleep disorders are obstructive sleep apnea and snoring. This video will show you how to set yourself up to the Embleta in your own home. We recommend you read over the hookup card again and familiarise yourself with the Embleta and sensors before you prepare for your study. The Embleta will already be pre-programmed to start and stop recording at the appropriate times. It is best to shower one hour before bedtime and allow yourself at least half an hour before the start time of your study in order to attach all the sensors and get ready for bed. Please apply the following steps. Now that you are at home, you will need to unpack the device and sensors to ensure you have the following items in your carry case. The Embleta straps, two respiratory effort belts, chest and abdominal, a nasal cannula, an oximeter, ECG sensors, four coloured electrodes for the head, preparation materials. These are the material you will use to prepare the skin for the placement of the electrodes. When you are ready for bed, wrap the Embleta MPR straps around your abdomen where it will be most comfortable while you sleep. Adjust the strap so that it is snug and secure. You may need to readjust the straps by loosening or tightening the Velcro tab. Be sure to turn off your mobile device as this may interfere with recording. This is the position for your ECG sensors. They should be placed just under your collarbones. Remove the backing of the black and red ECG electrodes, then place the black ECG sensor on your right hand side and the red ECG sensor on your left hand side. Now place the yellow sensor behind your right ear. Then place the green sensor on the middle of your forehead. Next place the blue sensor on the left forehead position above the middle of the eyebrow under the hairline. Place the orange sensor to the back of the left eye and down on the cheekbone. You have two respiratory belts. These are intended to be worn over your night clothes and not directly on the skin surface. Now locate the chest belt with the blue connector. Place this strap with the label connection facing away from the body, around the chest, above your breast area. The belt should be secure, but not uncomfortably tight. Locate the abdomen belt with the yellow connector. Place this strap with the label connection facing away from the body, around the abdomen and centre it just above the waistline. The belt should be secure, but not uncomfortably tight. Now for the nasal cannula. Place the prongs into your nostrils. Loop the tubing around your ears, then position the tubing under your chin and tighten into position by pushing the toggle to your chin. The nasal cannula is plugged into the lure lock of the embleta unit. Twist clockwise to tighten. This is how the device should look so far. To monitor your oxygen level accurately, you must remove any polish from your fingernail before securing the sensor. Insert the oximeter on your index finger. This is the preferred application site of the oximeter. Next, secure the sensor wire with a piece of medical tape. Before going to bed, you will want to check a few things in order to ensure a successful sleep study. Please check that the sensors are placed correctly on your body and check the sensors are firmly connected to the Embleta device. Now you are ready for bed. 
Upon waking, please disconnect the Emblator device and sensors from your body. Ensure you remove all used medical tape and stickers from the sensors. Your sleep study will be downloaded and analysed by your sleep physician. Then your clinician will discuss the results and treatment options with you. Thank you and sleep well.